and welcome back. This is Baller Scuba with more Let's Play Xenoblade Chronicles. I'm joined as always by my going back through the world squad of Ricky Melia and Dunban. Shulk, Sharla, and Ryan are in the back. I'm going to try a different setup today than I think I've ever tried before. I have re-equipped Dunban slightly. He now has a jungle top on uh, with a buff time plus one because I was starting to run out of gems that I liked. And then we have a black steel striker on him now. That is a giant sword that he is now wielding, putting agility up two, strength up two, and initial tension three on that. That is a gigantic sword that he is now wielding. We are going to head out again today. There's a little bit more work that I wanted to do. And in order to do that, we're gonna start uh, by backtracking. Back to Colony 9. This time we're actually going to do something out in the world of Colony 9 for a change. Uh, but in order to go there, we're going to have to start at... Uh, let's start with Tranquil Square. Let's just start there. Uh, we still have a lot of work to do in terms of side quests. We haven't even begun Frontier Village yet, after all. I do have a party with me that I hope will get some affinity together. I find that Ricky and Melia, because I always use them together, tend to get affinity together faster than, well, Ricky or Melia with anybody else. But I'm okay with that. All right, we're gonna drop down. I didn't know Melia looked like that when she fell. Now I feel bad. She like splatted on the ground, but she's fine. She recovered and we are going to head east. We're actually going to go to the Agora shore today. I think that I am a strong enough level to take on the enemies around there. Not all of them. There's definitely one or two hiding in the corners that I want to avoid. And there's one on uh, the one in the water one on the shore there that I do want to avoid as well, but I believe they will only spawn a little bit south of here. Still not ready to take on those throne sardi, but there are other enemies that I do want to show off because we haven't spent too much time here, after all. Uh, there are the stone crabbles, right? Those are quite easy. We do have the plain armus. Uh, let's go ahead and take on a couple of these. Well, at least one. All right, let's start with... Uh, Bolt, then Flare, and Aqua, and then we'll just start bursting things out. Alright, let's go for the burst end. No, I wasted it. Wasted it. Alright. Get a couple more things up. There we go. As you can see, the party does work out fairly well. Right. Dunban does need a heal every once in a while, but other than that, he'll be fine. Oh, I got uh, one of the wisps to show up for me as well. Uh, let's get the summon Aqua out a little bit here. Try to get a little bit of healing going. All right, we've aggroed a lot of enemies here, but I still feel good about this. Yeah, Ricky can heal from time to time. All right, we have a Chorty Skeeter along the journey with us today, and I can't really move here. There we go. There we go. Go ahead and start spamming some things. All right, get a little bit of healing in. I do want that after all. You know, living and all that. Oh, great. Now we get a vision. Ultra Life Absorb. How much is that going to take? 683. Alright, could we, uh, could we focus our attacks on whatever I'm on? That would be great. Um, let's go for a Blossom Dance here. Let's go for that. As you can see, he does it all by himself. I don't have to actually do that when I want them. All right, let's let's get rid of one of them. You know, let me summon something else. Didn't I just? Well, yeah, I still have two out. There we go. Discharge again. And get another electric out. Why not? First that. 
All right, we're, we're doing well here. We're doing well. Despite the fact that this is actually the same level that we are. Or I am, I should say. And we yoinked a heavy hook. That is what happens when you yoink. Not necessarily the thing that I wanted, but I will take it. Those aren't actually the enemies that I, were, that I was looking for, but we did get some pretty crystals. Those are level three. I will start showing off at least a little bit of the uh, crystal manufacturing, the gem crafting in a bit. But for now, uh, there are some specific enemies I am looking for, and Gentle Mother Armu is not one of them right now. She's a little bit too high level for me, I think. That's the tail, right? We can go around. Yeah, that was the tail. All right, we want to head up here. Not for the Chorty Skeeters. But I thought there was another enemy around here. Is it night only? It very well might be night only. But I thought they came out at all times. Have we seen this heart to heart before? Uh, we have not. It's uh, Ryan and Charla. Uh, we don't have the affinity between them yet. But we can see it at any time once we do get up there. Yeah, it's just the plain armies. All right, let's change the time to night. Just in case. No? Still the plain armies. I know they're around here somewhere. We at least got to see some new enemies today. But there are some other new enemies that I would like to show off while I am here. All right, we have the Shadow Vangs. We might as well take on one of those. Oh, I bet they're over there, aren't they? All right, let's take on one. Now you shall witness all, power. all right, Make Bolt, Flare, and then Aqua. Burst that out, and we'll let's just hope for the best. Who dares defy me? Oh, that reminds me that I got another... Um, I got another achievement off screen, and I'll have to show that off in a bit. We got it from uh, what I did with Dundam off screen. Go for another Aqua. Didn't I burst it out? Come on, let me. There we go. Yeah, she's doing a lot of damage. And we got. Is that a Skeeter out? Did we make a day already? Alright, we got a level for Ricky there. Yeah, it's a Skeeter. Alright, burst end. Just, just get rid of all of these. Just get rid of all of them. Down it goes. As you can see, we're taking pr some pretty heavy damage. Like I said, not necessarily the way that I would recommend things go, but it is a possibility. I don't like the way those things are running. Yeah, you have to be careful of gentle, gentle mother Armu. Oh, she just runs straight for the ocean sometimes or at least the water don't know if they're technically oceans around here all right we'll head over here because i want to at least take them on once but i do need to find them first are they around here i know they're on the agora shore i thought they were a little bit uh, higher than that there we go clinger antals now these guys are going to give us something that i need i believe for jerok's quest I need, I need some jaws. And this is how you get the ones that we need. Alright, we'll try to inflict a bind, I guess. As you can see, it's not necessarily the most useful stuff. We have a lot of things still to teach Melia. Before she gets super useful for me. But I guess I'll accept it as it is right now. Pretty much just trying to get more affinity between her and everybody else in there. She does pair well with Ricky. The damage over time team, I guess you could say. Now let's just burst it out. We're close to the end here. There we go, a quality and tall jaw, and that's the third one that I needed. Did we already take on these guys before? I don't remember doing that, but... Uh, that is the last of them. 
Just wanted to, to show those guys off a bit. Also, way back here, where is he? I know he's back here somewhere. Oh, there are some heavy brogs that I don't want to deal with. Uh, Gentle Rodriguez is hanging out back there. He is going to hang out there for at least a little bit longer. If you do not want to take these guys on, uh, you can trade with Sylveon, uh, who is south of uh, the Aether Light at night uh, with a four-star trade. And you can also trade with them with Jackson uh, if it's an overtrade of over 1,500 gold. Uh, but that's what I wanted to deal with right now. Let's head out. We got ourselves the Antal Jaws uh, that I did care about. So we're ready to move on. Let's head back to Bionis' leg. It's been a while since we've been here. We want to head, what's the closest spot? I guess here will be Kamos Guidepost. Uh, we'll head out to uh, the Daksha Shrine once more. I've already gotten the item that I need, but I feel the need to take on a certain enemy that we encountered over there that I ran from before. Now that I am high enough level, I want to try to take it on. It is not the Mount Torta. You know what? Let's take on the Mount Torta. We don't necessarily have to, but why not? That is one giant turtle with quite a bit of uh, fangy teeth on it. I did. Every once in a while, I feel like I'm using her wrong. I feel like I'm doing it right. I need to get another Aqua out. I need to put all the summons a little bit closer. Uh oh, there comes Savage. But you know what? Dunban's dodging. That's the reason that I have Dunban here instead of Ryan. Ryan doesn't work as well with this party. He kind of needs a healer, you know? He's getting hit way too much. Dunban, if he dodges right, then he doesn't necessarily need a healer. A designated healing all the time. But he could need one now. He could need one now. We almost got it down though. We almost got it. Down it goes. Melia gets another level up to 38. And has learned an art. That sounds nice. I, I did need an art. Hey, we got some turtle soup. The gray shell. All right, let's take a look at the art that uh, Dunban learned. I didn't bother leveling up arts or making anything important on skills, in case you were wondering. Uh, what is the art that you learned? What's the new one here? I must have missed it. It did say Dunban learned an art, didn't it? No, it was Melia that learned an art. What am I talking about? Melia, what did you learn? Summon copy. That is very nice. Uh, Resummon the last summoned elemental. So you can just start going into uh, things like, well, summon bolt, then summon copy straight away. And we'll get rid of hypnotize for that one. No need to put that on the board anymore. We'll go ahead and level this one up quite a bit. As you can see, the only thing that matters is the cooldown, and I do want that cooled down quite a bit. So, less than 40 seconds. So we're making progress. Anybody learn some skills along the way while I'm here? Yes, Shulk did learn Friendship Heals. Heals the party slightly after a chain attack. We're gonna start working on the pessimism thing, so he's gonna have good ether defense for a little bit. Increased vision time, sure. Uh, then we have reduces aggro drawn but from using arts. That's going to be quite useful for him. Uh, then we have epic invasion, evasion, increased chance of burst affinity after evasion. Uh, aren't they the same? No, these are a little bit cheaper as it turns out. A lot cheaper near the bottom uh, than the rest of the branches over here. So they do try to make up for you getting it so late in the game. Even though it's not late in the game yet, we're, we're still short a few things. But they do try to make up for it a bit. Oh. I should probably check everybody else as well. But uh, Shulk learned something. Uh, Charlotte did learn something as well. She has learned solid defense, physical defense up, up buff at the start of battle. Uh, we'll go ahead and teach her long range so that she can not hit things unless I tell her to from an even longer distance. All right, that seems to be it for skills for the time being. Let's head up and actually go where I wanted to go originally. 
Although, to be honest, I'm a little scared because we didn't have too much success against the Mount Torta. And what we're about to take on should be a little bit more difficult than that. Should be. Yeah, let's make sure I know where I'm going here. We need to go to the Daksha Shrine once more. And now that we are relatively high level, I feel comfortable taking on the surprise enemy that showed up there last time. And it's always weird, these things. Part of a quest, and then they just weird me out after that. I think it's some strange enemy that I need to take on. But it never is. All right, over to the Daksha Shrine. We'll just bypass all the Antals that are there. They don't have the jaws that I want, so we're not going to do anything with them. Not going to do anything with them. Instead, we're just going to run right past them and take on, once again, the surprise enemy at the end. I believe we already saw her? Him? Doesn't really matter. It's a spider, so... I think it's a spider. Could be an ant. Never really took close enough look at it. But either way, it doesn't deserve a gender, I guess. Mostly because I don't know how to tell them apart. <laughs> that way is always the best way. When you don't know, just say that it doesn't have one. Either It's probably a female, considering how big it is. But we're going to head all the way back to the end here the end of Daksha Shrine. Remember that we got ourselves the mirror from here before, but we did not take on the enemy. So let's take on Clifftop Byard. And let's get Bolt, Copy, Flare. If I can. All right, there we go. Clifftop Byard. Oh, toppled already, are you? There we go. The blaze on you into the aqua. Sure, why not? You got you guys want to hit like you were before. Like I didn't topple her. All right, we'll go for the bolt and then we'll try to get at least a little bit of regen going. Let's get aqua out. And that one hurt quite a bit. All right, I might not have the best party for this. All right, let's go help. Let's go help again. Ricky, can you get a heal, please? Like, I can only do so much with what I'm doing with, like, the 50 points per here. Ricky, you're supposed to be the one in charge of this. All right, we got Devour on Dunban. It does zero damage, but it does kill him. All right, simply smashing. I think we got that one as well. I still need to show off the achievements, don't I? Uh, can we get the heal? You can do it. Heal him. All right. It'll just do a little over a thousand damage, but that still sounds like a lot to me. All right, we need to burst that out. We need to start doing some damage to Clifftop Iron here. More damage to Dunban. Dive Impact 3. How much damage? 1499. That's enough to kill him. All right, Warren Ricky again. Ricky, I would love if you healed all the time. Dunban, please. All right, how many do I have out? I have two out. We're not even halfway here, are we? All right, we toppled. That's something. So I'm going to copy. First that out. All right, we're, we're getting this done. Okay, that did a lot of damage to everybody, but we'll be fine. Let's get the aqua out. All right, I think it is time to go, hopefully, for the chain attack here. Damn, devour all the time. All right, chain attack. Chain attack, please. All right, we'll just do an elemental discharge here. Wasn't the best, but we'll do what we can with it. Uh, let's go into uh, Sneaky. You know what? Let's go into a You Can Do It. All right, that worked out fairly well. 
Uh, we can absorb things. I was hoping that he had Blossom Dance, but it's kind of a long shot. I guess we'll go for a Gale Slash and hope for the best here. We didn't do much damage, but we got the heal in. And that might be hopefully as good. We're, we're close here. We're close. It's a little bit of a struggle, but we're getting there. Let's get the Aqua out again and hope for the Regenerates. He's getting to hit a little bit too much here. I am making this a bit of a challenge for me when it doesn't need to be by bringing this party along. Alright, Ricky, once again, heal, please. Alright, we're smashing a lot of these visions right now. Alright, discharge. Alright, burst end! Oh, I felt like we had it. I felt like we had it. We're so close. Am I the only one up here still? No, d d Ricky's here. Alright, down it goes. Down goes Clifftop Byron. That proved to be a little bit more difficult than I wanted it to be. But we get a giant king jaw, so I guess it was a male. A frigus striker, a quitter, and a thunderclap. I don't know what to make of those last two things, but we did it! Hooray! We're done here for now, then. I um, feel like I should change my party around just a hair. How about like that, huh? Maybe that'll be a little bit better for me. If I have a designated hero, healer and hopefully Ricky can tank. I tried it with Dunban. I tried. All right, we need to head back to the Satoru Marsh. We already had the Giant's Key, but uh, I wanted to, to kill that so that we can say I officially did everything there. So, or the, uh, sorry, the Giant's Mirror. That is what we wanted from there. But we got that one earlier. So let's head back to Exile Fortress. Uh, this time I believe we can go right through uh, the unique monster that is there. Because he does respawn. He is there every time you show up. I would not recommend taking him on, especially with the party that I have. We don't have the most uh, damaging party that I have available. We have kind of, everybody has a little bit of healing on them. Would like to change that over time, but for now, I think this is a good enough party. Hoping for the best. I could be wrong. I might need to change it at some point. But uh, back to the Exile Fortress we go. Back we go. Yeah, still a little early for, for Melia to really come into her own. Uh, she does have better things. Better arts that we will learn later. Still a lot of stuff that I'm not working with right now. Is he not there? Oh, he's not here. Alright, we'll just go right past everybody. And through the back. I thought he respawned. I thought he respawned, but we took him out last time. So no need to take him out again. Head back up to the roof here. Grab a couple things. Because why not? Even though I'm pretty sure I'm done collecting stuff for Sawtoro Marsh. Always good to have spares. Let's examine the altar. A strange object has emerged. And we get Daring of the Giants. And if I turn around, we can find defi Deified Queens here. Oh, they're actually too low of a level to, to aggro on me. Deified Queens. Let's take them on, though. This represents no problem whatsoever. Yeah, it might actually represent a, a problem for me. Oh, I went a little early there. I forgot to get the flare out. Alright, we're, we're getting things going here. Takes a little bit of time, but we got it going. The burst end didn't seem to do much there. Another bolt out. There we go. Get another bolt. Bolt! Thank you. 
Okay, we, we got this. We got this. Shit. Maybe we don't have this. No, we got this. This is why I have healers. Alright, let's get the copy out again. Just get rid of that. So much ether buffing going on right now. Which is really good for Ricky. It's one of the reasons that I do start with that. And another elemental discharge. We'll get Aqua out, which isn't the best, but it's there. Let me cycle between. And we get a vision? This is not good. This is just kind of a relatively normal enemy. Alright, Charla. Where's Charla? Back here. Charla! Hit that on yourself, please. Alright, and we have shattered that. And it's nighttime. Which might not be the best. Alright, down she goes. Let's go bring her back. Where Where is she? Alright, we got her. We got her. Let's cheer her up. Uh, hopefully it being nighttime up here is not going to be an issue. We still have more of these guys coming. Still have more coming and they're still going to kill Charla. Alright, Charla. Um, shield bullet on yourself? Will that do the trick? Yeah, it will do the trick. I feel like we're so close to killing this one. Alright, down goes one. Alright, you're doing fine. You're doing fine. I'm not doing so great, but you're doing fine. Let's get another thunder out. Get another copy out when I can. Would have been better with a different party, let's be honest. But uh, we're, we're doing this at the end of the day. We're only like five levels higher, but we're still doing it. Alright, we get the flare out. Go for the burst end. Reduce the defense. And hit you. Feel like this is doing good work. Let's get the water out, try to get regenerate going on a couple people. At least for a little bit. Got a lot of damage being done here. We got another item, we'll see that when the battle's over. Well, let me get another one out. Alright, straight into the copy. I probably should have done the, the copy on the flare. Either way. Go for more! There's some good damage. Get that out. Thought we had it. Thought we had it. Alright. Last one? Where is it? There it is. Alright, now with just one left, we shouldn't have too much of an issue with this. Hopefully. We have been battling these things for a few hours now. Just smack it as best you can. It's not necessarily what you're known for here. Do I wanna... I feel like the chain attack isn't really gonna help me, that's why I'm not going for it. Alright, we'll go into the flare first. It is chilled. That's something. Alright, into the copy. Back into the discharge. Yeah, that one didn't do all that much. Right into the burst end. Come on, get this. Oh, we get another vision still. Queen's bite again. When the focus is on Charlotte, that's not good. That's not good. All right, get the uh, the defense on yourself, please. There you go. Having her in the party makes it a lot easier sometimes. I don't think so. She survived, though. That's the important thing. We didn't shatter it, but she survived through it. 
All right, back up to full health. We have this down. We have this down. And down go the deified queens. And we get some queen cocoons for our troubles. 